and we're rolling! Hello, this is FD from Rolling with FD. And I want to tell you about the 5,000 subscriber contest. If you can help us get to 5,000 subscribers, we have something for you. First, subscribe to the channel. And when you subscribe, you make yourself eligible for the contest. After you subscribe, leave your favorite player or players in the comments and let us know who those players are. And once you subscribe and leave your favorite players, you're eligible for the contest. First place for those who win, you'll get a card or cards of your favorite players listed up to $1,000. Second place, the second place winner will receive one card or cards of your favorite players listed up to $250. And for third place, there will be five winners. Each winner will receive one piece of Rolling With FD merch and one lucky winner of those five will receive two pieces of Rolling With FD merch. Please remember to enter the contest, you first need to subscribe and second, you need to leave your favorite player or players in the comments. Once you do both, you have entered the Rolling With FD Road to 5,000 subscriber contest. Help us get there. We really want to, but we know we can't do it without your help. Thank you. Hey, what's up everybody? This is FD with Rolling With FD. G and I went to the Del Mar show by the Union Marketplace, Del Mar, California. This is an excellent show. We're going to show you now a lot of things that we got done in day one and part of day two. We're going to take you to the PSA table, show you what cards we submitted and why we submitted those cards. And not only did we submit those cards to PSA, I have another batch of cards that we're going to take to the slab doctor to have him clean to get ready for a grading in the future. There are some great conversations. You're going to see me talk to some people as they're coming into the show and meeting and greeting them and thanking them for arriving that day. Ooh, this thing is special, people. When I say special, I mean special. Check this out. G dropped the beat. It's on. Junior, hit him with it. Now you're singing, son. Hi, everyone. It's Monique from Drip, and it's Drip time. I want to tell everyone out there about Drip. Drip is a live streaming platform where you can buy sports cards, Pokemon cards, phone calls, or other collectible items at the click of a button from your phone. Use my link here and in the description below to receive 15 bucks off your first purchase of 20 bucks or more anywhere in the app. Remember to use my code on dripshot.live for $15 off your first purchase. We're here at the Union Show in Del Mar. Check this line out. This is day one. So G and I are gonna go through and say what's up to people. Welcome them to the show, right? That's what it's all about. We got a lot of children here, a lot of families, people about to have fun. So why don't y'all come with us so we can welcome them together. Ready? What's up, bro? Hey, welcome going? to the show. Thank you. What's up? Who's your favorite player, man? Tatis. Tatis. Soto? Soto. Good pick. Good pick. Good pick. pick. So, what's up with you? Who's your favorite player? Probably Hassan Kim. Okay. Yeah. All right. What about you, bro? Uh, if I had to pick a favorite player for the Padres, probably Hassan Kim. That's a good person to pick. My man. Hello, bro. How's Welcome to the show, man. I appreciate it, man. Thank you, guys, bro. Welcome to the show. You ready? Yeah, I'm ready. It's nice to know. Yeah. Y'all enjoy it. Go vintage. Yeah. Welcome to the show. Hey. Viking fan? Yeah. I'm a bear fan, bro. Where you from? Tucson, <laughs> Arizona. Oh, really? right I'm from Chicago, bro. Yeah. They real, I'm, I'm a fan, but they, they really don't have that great of a team like they used to. Nah, but their quarterback is shaking. How y'all doing? Good to see families here. Welcome, y'all. Thank you. What's up? How you doing? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Let's go. Y'all ready? Yeah. We're ready. Nice show? We're ready. Yeah, nice show. Who y'all looking for today? Josh Allen, particularly. Any uh, football cards, really, in general? Okay. Yeah, yeah. Right. Josh Allen. Go Steelers. Go Steelers, huh? Yeah. You got a pretty decent team there. Hope you found a lot of Josh Allen. Sounds good, All man. Right. What's up, y'all? Where did this place What's to go? What's going on? What's your name? Benny. Benny? FD. Carter. Carter, FD. I like what your Carter. What's my initials? Carter. What's up? Carter. What's your name? Bob. Bob? <laughs> I'm looking for him. Like yeah, a good, good card. Okay. I'm looking for a baseball card. Okay. All right. Are you mom? Yeah. I'm the mom of this one. Can I take a picture with him? Yes, you can. All right. 
Hey, how you doing, man? How you doing, man? You good? Yeah, I'm What good, you looking man. for in there? Uh, I'm just trying to boost some football. It's a, it's a bunch of people buying. Yeah. So just look around. We bumped into some people already. Oh, really? Good to see you all. See you all. What's up? How you doing? How you doing? How y'all doing? Good. Good. Right. How you doing, man? Good, good to see y'all. What's up, bro? How you doing, man? How y'all doing? Good. How are you? Michael Jackson. Michael Jackson? Yes, sir. Right. I want to see your moonwalk, bro. I don't do that anymore. <laughs> Bob Jackson. Bob Jackson. Nice to meet you. My nice father's name you. was Bob. Hey, yeah. Chris. And your nice name? Nice to meet you. My name is FD. FD. Yeah. Fire yeah. department? Fire department. <laughs> Putting things on blade. What's your name? Dennis. Dennis, go get it. All right. Probably not. How y'all doing? What's up? How you doing, man? How you doing, brother? How you doing, man? Love yeah. your videos, man. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, Thanks for up, coming, y'all. What's up, man? Appreciate it. How you doing? Appreciate you, bro. Hi. Uh, y'all love that, man. How are you? Yeah. Nice. How you doing, brother? What's up? What's up? What's up, man? What's up, man? What's up, man? How y'all doing? Good to see you, man. What's up, bro? What's up, bro? Thanks for coming. Thank you. We made it to the end of the line right now. Man, a lot of good stories in that. People looking for different stuff. It's going to be on people. We'll catch y'all back inside. Hello everyone, welcome to the Del Mar Show by the Union Marketplace, Del Mar, California. I'm honored to be the host of this show. So you'll see me moving around, talking to vendors. This is going to be real live. I'm excited! Hey, what's up everybody? want to welcome everybody to the Friday Del Mar Show. And right now we're at Taylor Jones, right across from the river. Let everybody know real quick, kind of stuff, how your day is going so far, what's looking forward to this weekend. Today is going great. Union Marketplace always puts together a great show. So what we got here is a trading card apparel from Mumbai. Let's check it out. Explaining all the different designs, but everything's inspired by the trading card market, collectibles. Just looking forward to a great weekend. A lot of friends, a lot of familiar friends here. It's going to be fun, man. It's always a great time. So Alex, Wiley, appreciate you guys, man. This is going to be a great show. Hey, everybody. Just want to say, welcome to the Union Marketplace Del Mar Show on Fly. Have fun. And we roll it. Hey, what's up, FD? How you doing, man? Tomorrow, everyone, what's your today? Well, first, I'm selling graded guards. I have the entire rainbow. I have them with PSA, BGS, CSG. So come by. They're only ten dollars each. Every color you can think of, or they're five for forty dollars. That's only eight bucks. So hurry up and get them before they sell out. Yellow is the first thing that sells. I also have, you know me, I have pop culture cards. So I have everything from Nirvana, Ozzy Osbourne, a million entertainment friends, Steve Martin, James Earl Jones, Ivan Cyrus, Simpsons, everything. I also have wrestling, tons of wrestling from WWE to AEW. So you don't see it in here, ask, I may have it. And believe it or not, I did bring sports. I have lots of soccer, football, and basketball. And you know, when you come by to see Murrow, you're going to have a great conversation. You know it, so come by. I'm at booth 107B next to the curator. So come by and say hello to Merle. Say hello to Merle and the curator. Thank you, bud. <laughs> Hey, what's up, y'all? You know that we picked up some cards recently that I've talked about getting graded. First off, is a 2009 Bowman that we picked up at Frankenstein, Steph Curry. Second is the green shimmer that we picked up at Burbank. And we're going to investigate to see what's the price of submitting these cards. And there are a few other here that I have in a stack that we may submit some of them. So we're going to go over and talk to PSA and see what's going on. Come on over here with me. So we have a few cards that want to submit for grading. What is the price associated with? Is it by different time schedules, right? Um, what do you mean by time schedules? Like how long it takes you to get your card back? So yeah, that varies on the service level, but it all is just based on what your card is. So if you have a membership at all of them. So starting price for you is $50. Okay. So that's anything if you believe your card is $1 to $999. And if you think it's more than that, the next service level will be $100. That's anything between $1 to $1,499. And then the turnaround time for the starting price is 45 days to 90 days. It could be more, it could be less. It just depends on your cards, obviously. Okay. And let me ask you this. Yeah. Like some of these variations, I forget the exact name of the card. Mm -hmm. Is there a penalty for not knowing that? No. Do your best, obviously. We want you to know your cards, obviously, but if you don't, that's totally fine because our research team evaluates your cards. Okay. So we look at the whole card description, we make sure it's actually correct. 
So if anything we find of your, you know, everything you left off, if something's incorrect, we'll correct it. And even if you find like, oh, they corrected this, but it's actually supposed to be like a gold refractor type of thing. And like the third or fourth step of the process, you can report an error and you can change, report the error and write down the proper card description. If you think we're incorrect, type of thing. But um, we'll correct it if you're wrong. But if you think we're wrong, you could also report that to us. Yeah. But yeah, you're going to have to start off by, or you can do it on your phone, creating an account, or you can pull it out on your account, and I can help you, whichever you want. So do I get on a PSA website? Yes, so you could either um, try to do it on your phone or on the yeah, whichever is easier for you. These are the cards we're going to submit. Steph Curry 2009 Bowman, Steph Curry Shimmer out of 5, Wiseman Pink Disco out of 50, number 4 out of 50. Wiseman 34 out of 35 blue. And then we got the uh, Nebula Spectra Wiseman 101. Boom. Boom. Don't do your <laughs> So as you can see here, I've taken all five of my cards that I want to submit put them in the online system. You can see all five cards are here and I'm about to hit next and continue the process to get these cards submitted. I'm in no rush about getting them back, so I picked the lowest service level, which would be the cheapest for me. That's just my rationale. If someone wanted them back quicker, they will pick another service level. Just saying. Good to go? Yeah. I appreciate you helping with the process. Of course, good luck. Cards are submitted. PSA. You all saw us turn cards into PSA, but I have a few more cards that need to go see the doctor, the slab doctor. I can pick them up later this weekend. This is not a today deal. Okay, sounds good. How you been? Good, sir. How have you been? Yeah, it's good. going. Good, bud. He's your boy. That's my boy. He's your, he's your boy. My man right there. I, I hope that he steers clear of, of any swings that Draymond yeah. might take. I think he will. I think he will. I don't think Draymond be that long. No. Such a knucklehead. You a Niners guy? I'm a D Bull guy. I'll take it. Yeah. I'll take it. That's no big. Five and six, right? Yep. I can count today. Thank you very much. Very well. helps you divide your stuff Have up. Fun. You can hit me anytime. It'll be Sunday. Okay. Don't uh, these, like you. these will be these will be ready tomorrow. Bye, bro. Yeah. Like, Thank you, man. Yep. Hey, my buddy. This is going to be a great event. Tiffany and I are going to talk more on stage about it Sunday morning. Sunday morning is going to be an event. We're going to talk more about it. But I want to shout out what she was doing for you. Thank you. Hey, everybody. It's Christmas time. We're here going to meet at the Grip Tank. Hey, everybody. You're going to have to get some of the so Drip, a little bit about us. We are a nine car platform. We need a variety of like people like sports cars, speed cars, comics, toys, even NFT. If you're a buyer, come on over to our booth to get fifteen dollars off your first purchase. If you're a seller, there's a lot of opportunities for growing your business on our platform. You know, we have five casting capabilities. We can send a cast to your social channel. It's like Facebook, Twitch, Instagram, YouTube. We can better our player to your website. We offer free shipping for our customers. We spend over $25. There's a lot of opportunities here. So please come check us out and say hi. It's real. Not. Live. At the Union Marketplace in Del Mar Show. Thank you, Monique, for coming over. Telling us more about what you did, what the company does. Everybody remember, great. Welcome to day two at the Del Mar Show. G and I are outside meeting and greeting attendees as they show up to the show waiting to get in. And a cool part of this morning is that I start the day off with an interview with Mark, Ultimate Pastime. Listen to this conversation. We have Mark, aka Ultimate Pastime here for a quick interview, kind of talk. So just let me know. There's a lot of people here, a lot of young people in the hobby. How did you kind of start and what excited you about collecting cards? What got me started? 
I've always been a sports fan. And when you can watch sports and then buy cards of the players that you're watching, as a kid, I thought that was the coolest thing ever. We would go wash cars and mow lawns to get money to go to either our local card shop or to Thrifty's Ice Cream to go buy packs of cards. And like, that's how it all started. I know we're, there have got some changes in the market. We're in 2022 right now. We're about to go into 2023. What advice or some things you're thinking about? So advice that you can give people just about how to navigate in that market. So, I mean, as you know, my, my, my slogan, my, it's buy what you like. That's okay? right. So when somebody asks me something, I'm going to tell them buy what you like. Now you have to find that fine line. Are you a collector? Or are you an investor? You know, and you, you got, you've got to figure out what side you're on because if you're a collector, you're going to buy what you like. That's right. If you're an investor, you might be buying into the hype and buying something that you don't know anything about and that could hurt you in the end. That's good advice. I know you've been around a lot of athletes over time, doing autograph shows, community kind of events. Give me one funny story of something you have experienced over time engaging with athletes. All right, well, here's a good one. I'll keep it PG. <laughs> That's good. We got to keep it PG. Yeah. So the date was March 28th, 1999. I got married on April 10th, 1999, 12 days later. And I worked with Will Chamberlain that day. And it was at the old Hollywood Park show. So I worked with him for like six or eight hours that day. At the end of the signing, he said, hey, Mark, thanks. I said, for what? He said, for getting married. This is Will Chamberlain. He said, for getting married. I said, what's the big deal? Will, I'm getting married. He goes, you're going to be tied down to one girl and you're leaving all the other women out there for me. <laughs> what was the first autograph that an athlete signed for you in person and the first card you added to your PC when you first started the play? The first autograph that I ever got in person I would have to say would be Rob Carew. Uh, great, great person to meet. We were just have we happened to be leaving the stadium. It must have been like in the mid '80s. My dad's like, "Hey, that's Rob Carew walking out right there." I said, hey, number 29, Rob Carew, you know, first base. I said, "That's awesome, man." I said, "He's yeah, go over and try to get a try to get an autograph." Like now, everybody wants a picture with the people. Yes. They don't want because everybody has a camera with yes. them all the time. So I went over. And I had one of those little mini bats from like the team store, and he yes. signed that for me. That, that, and that's the first autograph that I remember getting. The first card that I remember like putting into my PC, just having my business at such a young age of 14, I never really had the opportunity to have like a PC. Because everything kind of went into like my inventory kind of thing. Um, so I thought what was cool is in 92, uh, my dad and I were opening a box of 92 dollars and uh, we pulled the Cal Ripken Jr. autograph. So I ended up selling that particular version to my local card shop and reinvested that money into like my business at the time. But since then I've rebought some of those and that's like pretty crazy. It's great that you're the first person to come up here today and address it and want to tell your story. Oh, that's awesome man, thank you for having me and I uh, just want to thank everybody on behalf of the union for coming out here and making the show what it is. So thank you for having me. Mark, ultimate pastime. Thank you brother. Thank you bro. He always has great cards. Who's your favorite quarterback right now? Zach Wilson. Zach Wilson? Yeah. Zach Wilson. Very cool, man. Good throwing your thing, brother. Thank you. Yeah. How are you doing? All right, brother. How you doing, brother? Good. How's it going? Good. Good seeing you. Good seeing you. What are you looking for today? Golden State Warrior stuff. I did the one boys. Uh, I picked up that. First on the print. How much do I forget. Let me look it up. I just bought it. That's why I don't have a sticker. I'm so used to doing whatnot that I, I never put stickers. This is the first time I've done a show. Okay. 15, one higher. 75? Yeah, 75. How much is this? I do both for uh, 100. $100? Yeah, for both. You're the famous FP, so you know, we have to give them a deal. Good cards, man. You gotta come back. Don't worry. That's a great deal, though. Glad to give you a good one. It's a great deal, baby. Let me know. I appreciate it. What are you doing? Doing all right. I got the doors open, so I got a nice breeze now. Yeah, you do. Good, good to show. see you, brother. You too. Enjoy the show. Yep. This is wrong and it's hard to find. That's a card that's hard to find. Get a close up of this. It's hard to find, people. Acetate in a tin? Very hard to find. How you guys doing? How you doing, brother? All good, all good. Are y'all from Chicago? Yes, sir. What part? Down by Star Rock State you, Park, 90 minutes southwest of the city. Okay. Yes, sir. I grew up in Chicago. Oh yeah, yeah. what up? South side. You got it. Yep. See the curries? Oh, the LeBron is nice, though. What about this? 
I have that uh, asking 25 on them. You always have great prices, man. Thank you. Appreciate it. Mm -hmm. What you looking for today? Uh, mostly Golden State Warriors stuff, Golden like State young Warriors. prospects and kind of stuff. Oh yeah, any particular player? Oh, you got Wiseman, yeah. Kuminga, people like that. Okay. Yeah, no one's brought anything to me right now, but... I always wanted to keep going to a lot of team. He's a good player. Very good player. Yeah. Good in college. Very good player. I'm good in preseason, too. Yeah. yeah. Consistent. He can move, do things with both hands. Oh yeah. He's underrated because of that market. Yes, definitely. Nice card though. That's What's your price on that gold? I have it at 15. Number to 10. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. And I believe it's a pop five. Yep. Brother, I appreciate you. Thank you, okay. brother. Yep. Take care. Yep. Where you these from? These. Pick up. Pop two. Who I'm charged 10%. Yeah, this felt like five dollars. What did you do last game? How do you do? Oh, let's look at him. You don't see it this year. Oh yeah, bro. Season three. Let's bring it. Season three. 17 minutes. Seven for nine from the field, six rebounds, three assists, 15, three assists 15 points. He had a 15, six, and three night in 17 minutes. And I, that's how all of them are going to be. You, you got to come on, you got, then you got to go. Draymond might be gone this next year. He's not going to be back after this year. Yeah. Wait till the playoffs happen. Yeah, bro. He knows me. He knows me. I think way out. I'm not buying, I'm, I'm believe me, I'm not buying Wiseman. I'm thinking he's there. about to ball out right now. Out Way out. And a big man needs development. Every big man we know has had to have development. You can't come in a league, right, 18 years old, down there banging with grown men. That have been doing it up there. And then settle your shot. You, yeah, bigger bro. Than you, Hit your free throw. More athletic than you. Know how it is to be a big man to be tired? You got to get that. See, for an Asian, I'm, I'm, I'm tall, so that was made me play center, man. That's hard. You're I'm Asian, man. I play for all the short Asians, man. How tall are you? 5'9"? Yeah, bro. You balling, baby. No, you just down there calling for the rock. Yeah. Posting them up, man. Posting them up. Give them that wing. You know what I'm saying? Go right around. <laughs> Always, baby. We just saw something that is magnificent. And we're going to have the owner of the car to tell you more about it. Tell me your name. Tony. Tony? Yes, sir. FD. Nice to meet you. Tell us more about this car. This is a 2020 Topps Luminaire is one of one. It's 50 of the greatest home run kings of all time. So on the very first page, you start off with Alex Rodriguez, Ken Griffey Jr., and Albert Pujols. And it's got a lot of, lot of modern hitters, some of the older guys. You've got Reggie Jackson, Fred McGriff, Mark McGuire, Jeff Bagwell, kind of a big mix, Mike Piazza. All the way down to Aaron Judge, Anthony Rizzo, Bryce Harper, Juan Soto, Mike Trout's on there. It's uh, really cool. In 2019, they did Hit Kings, 50 of the biggest Hit Kings. That one just went viral and bounced around social media a couple weeks ago. So a lot of people recognize this and think it's that card. This was 2020, the next year. So Phenomenal car, people. One on one. One on one. Thanks for telling us that story. Yeah, absolutely. And Great also, to meet you guys. give everybody your Instagram. We used to do a break page. It's called Express Trading Cards. Uh -huh. So now my partner does High Roller Rips. That's his page. If there's a there page go. to follow, High Roller Rips is the one. So, right on. Yeah. Thank you, brother. Yeah, absolutely. And what's always cool about the Union Marketplace shows is that they have something for the entire family. Look at this Star Wars skit here. And look at all the families that are around, the children, the smiles, the faces. People are enjoying us. This is real cool. This is rolling with FD. G and FD. Like, subscribe, hit the notifications button. We plan to bring you more content. And there's more coming from Delmar. And we're rolling! Hey, what's up, y'all? I know y'all don't think this is over with. We got more content coming. Stick around. More FD, G, Delmar, Union coming for you.